Okay, we're back. I'm going to just discuss where we are right now with uh, matters. Um, we're successful in removing the broken tip of the screw, which was bed embedded all the way down in the base of the implant. Right now, I'm, I'm on 29. I took care of 28, and I put a healing abutment on there. Just any any external hex healing abutment that's at a regular platform. Now I'm going to just go ahead and remove the next screw and we're just literally just dancing that one out again tartar and stain goes in first acts as a lubricant also cleans what's in front of the screw broken screw uh, it cleans the bio burden um, so. a few more turns here and this one will be out We have the wrong screws ordered. We have to get that reassessed and uh, and your suction ready. There we go. Okay, let me give it another twist here. That should come out. Okay. Let me get this one. Okay. Keeping all the parts as we're going to make another order. Okay, I'm going to go right down and scrub that with cavity cleanser first. Uh, Concepsis from Ultradon. Just doing that. That tip's not on all the way. All right. And there's a big piece of bio burden coming up. Okay. Flush that out. Right. I'm going to now go in there with proxy brush. Bending it. Working it, examining it with different colors. Then we're going to check the threads. Okay. All right. Microsection. Good news is you don't have to go through surgery. Uh, we'd like to keep all the components, just change out the abutments, screws, and make everything match. Uh, hopefully, they still make that size. If we can, you know, we'll, we'll find a way. So there's still bio burden down in there. So I've got to go down a little more TNS. let it soak a little bit. This is where you got to have some patience. Okay. Now, let's see if I can get that to come up. really hard to tell down there. I need another um, cavity cleanser syringe. Okay. Okay. They're all like that. They have to be turned. Yeah, they're all like that. Okay, here we go. Okay, let's vacuum that out. Microsuction. All right. All right, here we go. That should be squeaky clean in there. We'll look 
down inside. Okay, well, you can see, look at the threads on that. All beat up on that one as well. All to the buckle. So. Okay. Here's our next abutment. Healing abutment, that is. one in there. I've got to give that a little hand tightening. Let's see if the threads, maybe this one's, yeah. Uh, let's see how this one works. Open up again a little bit. Thank you. Good. That one hand tightens. And that one. So now these two are going to keep those two implants happy. And now we got the last one in the back. Doc, do you need a break? Are you okay? All right. One more to go here. Okay. All right. And you can see that one has a flathead screw because that's telling us that it's coming from a different angle. So that angle's in, and there's the flathead screw, and it's got a definite angle out. So, all right, interesting. That's an interesting, uh, of course, that gets tightened. And then it gets there's a screw going this way and one going that way, and then of course a third screw. So there's three screws to this component. So why don't you close and rest? I'm going to see if I can find a large, a longer abutment, uh, and we'll come right back on the next clip to cover that.